I'm IMBD Ray, and you're watching my channel. Have you ever wanted to go outside, sit there in the hot sun, cook up some good food, make sure it tastes good, bring it to your little brother so he can taste it for you and tell you if it tastes good, then take it to your cousin and bring it to him so he can tell you if it tastes good? Well, shoot, you're in luck, because today you're going to see me do that, and that's why you should drive a Ford F-150. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about, but uh, let's get into the video. <laughs> Out of all people, you know what I'm saying? I'm the wrong person to try to be in the kitchen cooking against, you know what I'm saying? Two videos ago, that said at the end of his video that he was going to be able to cook better than me in the cooking competition. And today, I'm cooking for real because I really do this on some real stuff, like on some everyday when I'm at home type stuff. Might be capping a little bit, but you know what I'm saying? That's, that's besides the point. Anyways, you picked the wrong person. You should have told Bryce. You should have told uh, 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 Isaac or uh, what, what's his name? Spider. Not me. I'm the wrong person to be doing this with. Now today, I'm going to just be showing you a little bit of something. You know what I'm saying? I don't get to do this every day. Since I'm here, I'm bringing this to my channel. And I'm going to show you a little bit of something. What you got yourself into. I don't know when this video going to be coming with me and you go up against each other. But right now, I think you need to practice. This is going to be my practice. But you know, my practice is already made perfect before. I, you know what I'm saying? I did this many times. It's not my first time doing this. So, man, I don't know what you thought you was going to yourself into today but man let me let you know i am not to be played with today i got my cousin here man man you know it's jordan follow me on instagram <laughs> seriously jordan underscore okay okay and today man he finna be recording for me today or helping me record a little bit dang i ain't uh finna be helping me record a little bit today man we ain't even had no thanksgiving let me tell y'all bro we did not have a thanksgiving we been here this whole week by ourselves because he came down from new jersey i ain't want to leave him down here by himself you know what i'm saying but look Today, starting up with some ribs. I'm not making no size. I don't need to do all that. It's only two of us here, you know what I'm saying? So I'm about to show y'all how I season everything up, you know what I'm saying? Zach, take notes. You know, you need to do this right now. All right, man. This right here, when you making ribs, is number one. You got to go get it. Tell your mama and your daddy about it because they most likely don't know. I use this one time. Now, I know you see it says orange pepper. I use this before on ribs. And, man, I had somebody who, who was a real-life professional. Like, I'm not capping. Real life. Professional real maker, supposedly he won a couple medals or whatever, but I don't know if he was capping to me, like just trying to make me feel good about myself or not, but I don't, I don't really think he was. This right here, A1, you know what I'm saying? This will make your ribs taste, you don't have to put nothing else but this seasoning, but I'm, I might add a little something, you know what I'm saying? But you really don't have to put anything else but this. I, 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 you know what I'm saying? Today we got a slab of ribs, you know what I'm saying? This is a huge slab of ribs, I don't know, it was a... I ain't like, it's big, but it was cheap. Like, $9 for this whole thing right here. We finna eat good today, baby. So now, shit. So, man, what you want to do? This doesn't have a lot of salt in it, man. You can put a lot on it. You know what I'm saying? I really need to use the other side because for, for one, this is ribs, man. You don't, you don't lightly coat this, you know what I'm saying? And then you're going to rub it down, you know what I'm saying? Zach, take your notes, man. You know what I'm saying? You're going to do this and you're going to rub it down, man. All the way across, both sides. I really could have did this in the sink, but y'all be tripping. I ain't seen it on uh, so many people TikTok. They was getting on their case because they did it in the sink. Like, bro, y'all don't understand. If you wash the sink out, you'll be good. You know what I'm saying? Don't rub it in on both sides. And look, I'm gonna have my cousin tell y'all if it's good too. Don't cap. You gonna rub it in on both sides. All right, so pretty much that's all you gonna do. I ain't really had time to marinate it. You know what I'm saying? Keeping me in overnight or none of that because I just started this. Yeah, I realized I just started this, so it wasn't like. A thing that I was gonna do over a period of time, it was just like random video, you know what I'm saying? And for those of y'all who don't think I wash my hands, bro, I've been doing this already before I even started the video. You know, I wash my hands already, so don't be up here trying to say, D Ray, D Ray, you're nasty, dude. Why didn't you wash your hands or whatever, bro? I'm really the goat. You know, you don't talk to the goat while he in the kitchen. Better go ask your mom about me. Ask your mom about me. Ask her where I was at last night. <laughs> Coming together, no cap. You know what I'm saying? I'm really the goat. Now look, I ain't let them marinate or nothing. You know what I'm saying? Overnight. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna sit them in there for probably about 20 minutes, just let it stick. But that's pretty much it. Now, cause we got a season. That's all you need. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. You don't believe me, but that's all you need. It don't even have a lot of soot, salt in it, so it's gonna be good. You know what I'm saying? Orange pepper right there, just like that. All right. So basically, now I'm finna go put the firewood on the grill. You know what I'm saying? You ready to cook it up? But before we go outside, gotta put the shades on so I can look like your daddy. Over here, man, 
charcoal. You would be using regular charcoal, you know what I'm saying? But you don't have any. These last longer. Mm -hmm. And since I'm gonna be cooking ribs, you know, I gotta. You know I gotta let them smoke. So it's gonna be on here for a minute. So we need something that's gonna last a long time and keep the heat in there for a little minute, you know what I'm saying? So, today, man, we have bricks. And you want to strike that thing good, you hear me? You need to grab that bear. And I'm gonna let the excess off. You don't have to do the bottom part because on the bottom side, the fire will get all that gunk up off the bottom. Dude. So, what you want to do is you want to keep it here, you want to scrape all of that old gunk off the top of the grill so that it won't stick to your food or any of that lighter fluid that gets in there doesn't, you know what I'm saying? It'll be gone, it'll be off. We're almost done. Yeah, that right there is what you call a fire, baby. We're about to be back in business, baby. Let's go check on those ribs. Now that you hear the crackling of the grill, don't mind my hair, man. I just woke up and just decided to do this. But now that you hear the crackling of the grill, it's time. About that time to put the ribs on the grill. It's at uh, a temperature about 250, you know what I'm saying? Well, before I opened it, it was at 250. Go, put the ribs. Oh, shit. Grab the, the ribs on there. Slap it across. Okay, so all my batteries died, I ain't gonna lie. I've never, my camera batteries have never died in the middle of a video. But like I was saying, you know what I'm saying? Put the ribs on here sideways, man. Shut up. Tell them, yeah. these ribs finna be the best in the world, ain't they? They finna be the best in the world, ain't they, huh? The best in the world, huh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I don't think you're ready, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Man, how that shit taste? Nasty. No, that shit good, bro. No cap. Look at it, man. Plating skills is a hundred. Mm. Mm -hmm. So basically, man. You heard it here, Zach? My stuff is good, man. You're gonna have to come hard. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how you're gonna do it. But if you win, I feel like you can't. You might have to do that. Because I am a little cold with it, you know what I'm saying? So you might have to put some little side bits on the side in order to win this, you know what I'm saying? No cap since six years old. And make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe in this video, man. I know I'm probably making y'all hungry by watching this, so I ain't gonna hold y'all for too long. Let me see y'all. Let me see y'all. It's too much money be beating my hoes and niggas is broken be tricking on hoes.